Yes, yes, yes. The new niggas back. The new niggas back to teach you some new niggas shit. To tell you some shit that only the new nigga gonna be able to tell you. You understand what I'm saying? See, these motherfuckers, they gonna lie to you. But now nah, I'm gonna tell you the truth. You know what I'm saying? Everybody wanna believe in their boyfriend upstairs and shit. Oh, my boyfriend upstairs, my boyfriend upstairs. Let's put it like this. If you had a boyfriend, which you do, you know what I'm saying? And that boyfriend left the house at 1 a.m. in the morning last week, last year, damn near before you got born, bastard ass. <laughs> uh, anyway, your boyfriend lives upstairs. You scared of your boyfriend. Your boyfriend said you should not have nobody else before him. He left you in the house with no food, no money. You hear some stuff going on upstairs. Sound like maybe kids or something. PlayStation playing. You know what I'm saying? So you begin to look upstairs when you're in trouble. When you know you don't got no food in the house. When you ain't got shit. So you look upstairs because you think your boyfriend's upstairs. Or rather you know your boyfriend's upstairs because you heard that rumor that your boyfriend was upstairs. So you get on your knees and you look upstairs and you say, boyfriend, can you please give me some groceries? Can you please give me some milk? I don't have any milk. You can't get your boyfriend's milk. Because your boyfriend's upstairs and he's gone and he never came back for you. And he told you that if you love anything more than him, he is going to beat your ass. Now tell me, how would you lay in bed with a man that says he will beat your ass? How you lay in bed with a man that tells you if you do anything out of his wishes, he will burn you alive? And this is what you call love. <laughs> this is what women have been taught as love. This is what men have been taught as love. Do you understand what I'm saying? See, I don't know what island you come from. I don't know what nation you choose to come from because there's really just the planet and everybody comes from Africa, the motherland, which is Earth. You understand? Because you was created, you created man here. For a purpose. And that is to love that bully motherfucker that will beat your ass. You understand? Beat your ass and burn you alive. Now, see me? <laughs> I'm a magical unicorn. You understand? When you see a transgender... Transsexual, hermaphrodite, call us unicorns, because we some magical motherfucking unicorns. You understand what I'm saying? And for everybody that likes to wonder, 
Yes, I got a dick. And you can suck this dick and receive power. You understand? <laughs> See, I don't suck dick. You understand? And if I do suck dick, I'm sucking it for power. I'm sucking it for money. I'm sucking it for sex. I'm sucking it for more of whatever gratitude I want from it. So I'm telling you, come get some of this unicorn milk. And you will be blessed. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to fear me. I'm not going to try to beat your ass if you don't love me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You can call me the abomination. Call me Lucifer. It doesn't matter to me. Inky. Inky Hugh Lucifer. <laughs> I ain't soft Lucinda Karma. Why are you afraid of your lover? Tell me, please.